Hey everybody, Jay Barino here, and welcome back. We're continuing Chronicles of the Second War. We made it to Act 3 this time. I don't know where the background is, but let's go ahead and get started. Uh, these Act's introductions seem like they take quite some time, so this video might be pretty long because we're including this with the mission itself. After Stromgard fell, the hordes swept across the Arathi Highlands like a locust swarm, leaving only devastation and death for its inhabitants. When the Orcish army faced the mountains in the north, Orgrim Doomhammer ordered a search for a passage that could lead to the Northlands of Lordaeron. Humans and their allies believe us to be mindless brutes. I intend to exploit that fact. Even now they sit in their walled castles and townships, expecting us to throw ourselves at their defenses with impunity. Instead, we will be doing exactly the opposite. Gaze upon the horizon, Ren, and behold the Thoridan Wall. This line of fortification spreads across hundreds of miles and is said to have never been breached. I have no intention of sacrificing our warriors to break through it. But why didn't we just go around the mountains or use our ships to bypass the mainland? Because, Main, they would be expecting us to try that as well. And, uh, if we reach the Northlands through the mountains, we can cut off the elven supplies that the humans will desperately need. You speak wisely, War Chief. I bring important news from Sarvan. We could not break the gates of Ironforge. None of our weapons had any effect. We have failed you, Warchief, and will accept whatever punishment you deem necessary. Hmm. Maintain the siege and let them starve. Send the rider with my words to Veron. The burning blade and the bleeding hollow plans will remain in Cosmodon to suppress any attempts to sabotage our armies and supplies. And you, Ytrig, will join my army here in Lordaeron. By your will, War Chief. Pick up the pace, warriors. We must get through these peaks as fast as possible. One more week of marching, and we'll be reaching the borders of Quatalas. Though I be trying my best to keep myself composed, the prospect of revenge and justice be making me axis mighty restless. And as I promised, your people shall have their vengeance, mighty Zul'jin. But before we can invade the Elven lands, we must first strengthen our position here. My scouts have informed us that the Alliance forces are gathering near the Deramir Lake. I have ordered the Storm Reaver and the Twilight's Hammer clans to head up to the riverbed. Gul'dan and Cho'gal will distract the Alliance while Mame and the Blacktooth Green Clan attack Tyr's hand. That leaves Stratholm, the jewel in the north, and Lord Ron's second largest city. While it stands, it will be impossible to launch an assault on Quel'Thalas. There'll be many troll hideout in the forest, between these mountain and Stratholm. If we find them, they will be needing little convincing to join the Horde. Excellent. Have no doubt, Sul'jin. We will liberate your homeland and slaughter those who wronged you.
So the rumors are true. The troll leader did ally himself with the foreign beasts. We should warn the Thine. Warchief, I was told that you wanted to see me. Wutong, travel north ahead of us to Deramere Lake. Wuldan and his clan are establishing a base camp on its shores as we speak. I want you to monitor his activities. It will be done, Warchief. Gul'dan and his lackeys shall obey your commands under my watch. Zul'jin. I've been informed that there is a troll pack that has just entered our camp after hearing that you've accompanied us. They're asking for an audience. Great Chieftain Zul'jan, we be from the Wilted Bark tribe. We bring word from our kid that be fighting the dwarf clans in these valleys. We heard that you gained a mighty ally that could help us win this war. Greetings, mighty sons of the Wilted Mark. What you heard be true. With the Horde at our backs, we will be bringing ruin to all who have wronged us. The dwarves of these lands included. Praise the Loa! Your arrival be timely, man. The bearded vermin been gaining the upper hand as of late. We've been feeling the touch of Boswandi for months now. Gaining the upper hand, eh? I believe it be time to shake things up a little then. What you say? Ready for a little retribution? For Zulaman! For the Horde! For Zulaman! For the Horde! All right, the runestone at Kaer Darrow. Having sensed the presence of a powerful elven runestone, the orcish warlock Gul'dan has dispatched a Stormreaver clan to the shores of Lake Daromir. Convinced that the runestone is located on an island at the heart of the lake, Gul'dan calls on his apprentice Cho'gal to help him secure its vast magical power. All right. Okay. Craftsmanship? Do these sights make your stomach turn? Surely the war chief does not tolerate these vile acts. I will be reported. <laughs> the war chief himself sent me to purpose, and all that I do here is done in his name and with his blessing. Were you not his plaything? I would have repurposed that witless soul of yours long ago. Now, return to your scratching and leave me to my work. I am expecting some. Mm hmm? 
Master, we have brought this juggernaut to aid you. What is the plan for the Storm Reaver troops in this region? Excellent, my apprentices. Now, listen closely. Just to the north lies the elven kingdom of Quel'Thalas. The war chief intends to destroy it. Their warriors are deadly, and their walls are strong. But it is all built on magic, and therein lies their weakness. At the center of this lake is an island housing a powerful relic of the elves. An enchanted runestone, shimmering with arcane energies. Yes! We can feel it from here! The runestone and this region is guarded by Alliance troops. If we manage to break the Alliance here and capture the monolith, we will achieve two goals at once. Learn much about the magics of Quell Salas and gather the magics here for the hard. Exactly. All right, we got Gul'dan this time. Let's get this going. Yes. He's on lumber, that's to fine. To the runestone, I will need to come into direct contact with it. Bring me to the monolith once you have cleared the island of those pale dogs. The pale dogs approach. All right, he's a warlock of the Storm Reaver clan. Powerful caster is able to summon demons, siphon life, and use fell energy against his energies. A energies? En enemies. He uses fell energy against his enemies. Destroy the human castle, secure the runestone. To capture the runestone, it will need to come into direct contact with it. He already said that. Orc Archer. Storm Reaver clan uses Orc Archers for their range attacks. Upgrades can be found on the War Mill. Cool. Okay. So, that's rolling. We're just getting dudes going. We want to find... There's there's another gold mine. That's, that's nice. Oh yeah, he's got the he's got the thing that like he calls it down from the flipping sky and it smashes him. That's awesome. That was a good net. Admittedly, that was a great net by that enemy. I cannot even be mad about that. Okay, we're gonna kill some wolves. Chaos bolt. And soul drain. And oh, okay. Use take get mana from health. That's cool. Uh, okay, let's keep rolling here. Let's get an oil tanker because I. This, oh, never mind. We need pig farms. Okay. Seems like I just started with a bunch of stuff, just sort of around. We have enforcers. Fine. Okay. Be happy to. Work. Work. Okay, let's keep rolling. Uh, we can use Chogol's ultimate on this. Can raise undead from corpses. Okay, all right. I'm intrigued. This is exciting. This is exciting. It didn't hit that many things, but it hit enough things to be to be cool. Okay. Let's keep flying around here. Did I lose... Was this the same Zeppelin, or did we lose one of the Zeppelins? I will not be denied. Okay, keep rolling. Hit this. That is a good amount of damage. Certainly. I think he's just meant to be a great hero. I will not be denied. Utak, grab the meat. Actually, give the meat to Cho'Gal. That is my task. Your soul to well. Yeah, Gul'dan seems very, very strong. You love to see it. Okay, we can't break that. There's oil, but it's way down there. I think we just want to get it set up as soon as possible. We have a thousand gold, which is not quite enough, I feel like. Or, I'm sorry, we have a thousand oil. It's not quite enough to get off the ground, but hopefully... 
um, we'll be able to get our oil income set up and things will start picking up here. Um, what do we want to do over here? Can we get up there? It looks like we have no way to get ready to work across to there until we get more boats set up. Okay, oil tanker, let's roll on down here. Zeppelin, we're going to leave you over here. More meat. And I see murlocs. Okay, this is what we need to be doing at the beginning. There's also no music. It's a little eerie. It's just a little eerie. Okay, that guy was still asleep. Okay, I'm going to come on over and take this second base as soon as possible. Certainly can't hurt. It gets us set up near some tr more trees as well in case we need them. Early lumber. Darkness Ready to work. This realm's power will be mine. The time has And we just come. want to clear out all of this stuff just to ensure that we have some safety here. I don't like that. Mine is the only way. The Alliance is attacking. Defend the camp. Okay, well we found where they drop. Serve me well. We have a juggernaut. It's basically a catapult. I think it does some friendly it might do some friendly fire like catapults would okay and then let's run let's just keep walking up here we saw it looked like they dropped way up there so we can build some defense kind of in that area all right this seems clear to take the sooner we can get this going the better it's almost like we want to build shipyards kind of down there do i have a transport ship i do keep making workers hmm Something you're doing? And then let's just gr take a worker and maybe drop him off down here and build an oil refinery. I will not it's be tempting worried. almost to close the game and restart it because this lack of music is a little I will eerie. Not be denied. Let the suffering come so it seemed like they dropped units a maybe here and they walked begins. through these trees to get to us. I'm not 100% sure, but we're going to have to defend this. Which is sort of something I guess we'll have to worry about later. Complete. Burning Ready oil, not a super necessary thing that I yes. am interested in. I, await your orders, Captain. Ahoy, Captain. I vaguely remember there being a gold mine down here. Yes, Captain. I guess we can worry about that later. Let's go ahead and get another oil tanker. As we've learned, I feel like oil oil Zeta early is Blade. super important. What exactly are you up to? Hmm? Be happy to. Okay, so let's do it. No, not a foundry. I mean, we do want a foundry, but we don't need it right now. Okay, let's do that. And then I also need a foundry. Feels like we have a long time on this one to get set up before things really take off, which is good. Okay, gold there. That's great. You guys stay. Um, I guess come on over here and destroy these murloc huts. We're going to have them just sort of defend that area. Let's get a few more pig farms. So that we have them. And then I think we want to go stronghold really fast. Should come on over and repair these. Did they give me a blacksmith to start? They did. It's not that expensive, so let's grab those. And then we're going to want to grab a worker and build a foundry. What do you want? Okie dokie. Build more ships. We must break the Alliance fleet. Okay, this is actually great. And yeah, I want to build more ships, but it's very expensive, dude. We'll give me a, give me a break. Yes. Uh, change this. Wait, something's happening. Okay, hang on. Music's playing. The Storm Reaver Clan dispatched war turtles to aid us against the Alliance Navy. Why are they not here? These rivers are ill-suited for the great beasts of the Southern Seas. They must have been slowed down and lost track of our ships. Enough excuses. You will find our turtles, Scratcher. 
or I will report your failure to the war chief myself. I will find them, Gul'dan. See to it that you do. It would be a shame if your title has made you weak in the face of true labor, Overseer. Don't talk to Utak that way. Don't do it. Oh, that warlock is starting to vex me greatly. Never talk to Utak that way. Okay, oil is on the way. The turtles are hiding beneath the water's surface. They could be spotted either by a zeppelin or by another turtle. Okay, fine. Um, this is what I wanted to do. Just make me a tower. This is just about done. The seal is in the way. You get to live today, seal. Okay, and then what next? We have the foundry. Upgrade my ships. Absolutely critical. And then I would like to look for more oil. I think that over here is where we need the most defense. Destroy, destroy. Because we can build our own ships, just sort of like chill near the coast here, and that should keep your us safe. Yes. Go well. Gold and gold. Yeah, I see. I see. I see that well. coming in. The time has come. I will not be can we stun the boat? My yeah, we can. Fantastic. Okay, and we got a war turtle. That just gives us vision. They appear to have still been able to drop their units, but that's okay. Okay, the important thing here is that we have some oil income. It's not a ton, but it's enough. And then Juggernaut, let's bring you over here to get repaired. And then let's build a few more destroyers. We will need more oil. It looks like we can get it maybe over here, so we maybe want to build a refinery kind of on the edge down yes. there. Hmm? Okie dokie. So let's go oil refinery there. And then we'll get even another one over here once we find the rest of the the turtles, which that's going to be its own thing. There's two. Once we get enough turtles, we can use them to assault the oil refineries on the outskirts here like this one. Okay. Um, I don't want to get too close because then they, they can shoot us down, but we obviously want to grab this. They can, see, they can see our turtles with the flying machines. As long as the turtles can be seen, they're really fragile, so that's just something to sort of keep in mind. Okay. Juggernaut, come on down here. We just want to make sure we keep this well defended. And then this might be kind of a freebie. It's very close to their shores, but we do need it. So let's not overbuild our, our oil tankers, but we may need those. You come on over here to this gold. Let's build a few... Let's build a few towers here, just in case. It feels like this is the area they're going to want to attack. Work complete. Okay, this seems perfectly fine. I can leave these here to defend us. And then as we build more and more juggernauts, we can then just do a big assault on the ground versus versus our enemies and stop them from being able to drop on us. And then this up here, it's unclear how to even get up there. Maybe we can traverse that? I'm not sure. It's something that I'm sort of... I'll worry about later. I'm not too concerned about it right now. Okay, and then oil tanker, come on over here. I don't want to overbuild oil tankers, because these get mined out really fast. It seems like they get mined out pretty darn fast. Okay, and there's something in the bottom left as well we might want to deal with later. Maybe, oh, maybe it's like we can come all the way down and then go up and around to get up to that stuff. Yes. And right now, I'm not too concerned about it. Mm -hmm. Can't build there. Can't build there. Work complete. Let's just make sure that we're good. Work complete. 
Okay, we can make a fortress now. We have plenty of money to do it. So let's start it, and let's grab pillage while we're at it. Um, what else? Just break these crates and see if we got something for Gul'dan. Again, still no music. <laughs> um, how are we doing on oil? Pretty good. 2,000... Yeah, let's just, let's just go to plus two. Absolutely critical. We get all of our normal upgrades over here because we got plenty of resources to do it. So just keep getting our upgrades. There's no upgrade here for our enforcers, unfortunately. Work completed. So it's destroy the human castle and find the lost turtles. It seems to me like those turtles could be anywhere. This oil's We're almost out, completed. and then we'll just transfer these over to the Windows. other one. Yeah, sure, make a cannon what tower. A bit Research tempting to try and make a a barracks over here so that we can start sieging stuff, but it looks like there's no room to build it, unfortunately. Because there's some human stuff over there Something for sure. Work, work. <laughs> Awaiting your order. Um, I'm thinking we just want to continue making... Honestly, we're kind of at the point where we only need to make juggernauts. Um, let's just get a few more destroyers so that they can shoot air. Well. They also get broadside shot. Okay. Use incendiary ammunition, causing them to light the area on fire. Okay, so burning oil applies to... We're our complete. juggernauts as well. That seems really good. Speak, I really just... I'm just trying to find these turtles so that I can just kind of leave them where we find them so that they can scout stuff. Our oil packs is running low. That's fine. Work completed. This is an interesting little island. There's something up here. Gold mine here. Again, I need I need a new talk strike group to clear this stuff out. Okay, turtle found. Kind of chill over here. Let's get that burning oil upgrade. Seems like it would be pretty valuable, and it's cheap, too. Very cheap. We can get plus three attack. I didn't know that that was a thing, honestly. Time is money, friend. Okay, it seems to me that the next thing we want to do is get set up down here. It's, it also seems to me that they're mostly attacking here. It seems like they're constantly just trying to roll kind of in this direction. So as long as we're prepared for that, we should be good. Yeah, you guys, this is why I said I needed destroyers. So bring them on over here. We're going to get rid of this jerk. And you know what? Go ahead and start building a tower here. Just so that if this continues to happen, we can shoot them down. Oil patch depleted, that is acceptable to me, and that is because these can be repurposed over to this patch. I think we want to take this out pretty pretty quickly. And by pretty quickly, I mean that's... Yes, that's what I'm going to do. Great, good work. Oil tankers. Rowing and rowing. Okay, so what do we need in order to make this happen? Probably get some ogres. And we need to drop them over here and then World siege that turn. bottom left town. That seems like it would be valuable. It gives Remain us access to two dead. gold mines as well. And we can get rid of the humans being able to help each other, essentially. Yes, we don't really need to defend this area anymore, so we're going to move you over here. Set the course. Oil's coming in, but not, like, super quick or anything. I think we can get... Something to do. It's time. Plus three. 3,000 oil. It's crazy, but, yeah, let's just get all of this. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then what we can do is just get some... workers over here on trees. Again, it's a little unclear to me where the enemy attacks are coming from. This isn't particularly... I, won't, I don't think this is particularly challenging. It's just making sure that we find where we want to attack first and where the enemies are coming from. All right, go ahead and repair this. 
turtles, I guess, keep looking around. I guess we could bring boats all the way down and drop down here. Ready to work. Um, anywhere I can build a forward barracks would be valuable. <laughs> and I think we just leave our heroes here. What? Oh. Yes. <laughs> I can do that. Ready to work. Um, do I have anybody that can attack air? I have two archers. That should be enough to kill this thing. Oh, I have three archers. Get up there. And then let's, I guess, give them some, some upgrades. And then we can ensnare if we need. That jerk just kind of came out of nowhere. Here, get healed. Um, okay, what's the first step? Let's grab our catapults, and let's just grab these units, bring them down here, load them into the boat. We're gonna bring Utak, because it's the Utak strike force. It's gonna take him a while to get up there. And then I need another... transport ship. We can bring him. And then we're gonna make some juggernauts. We need the oil to do it, but that's fine. We got, we're up to plus three. I can't really hit anything from the shore. I mean, I kind of can, actually. Over here. You're the captain. Build more ships. We must break the Alliance fleet. No mish submarines? What manner of joke is this? Use our goblin zeppelins to track them down. Wait. And send those halflings to a watery grave. Why was I just able to see it for like a half second and then it went away? Yes, Captain. You're the Captain. Okay. Other ship is Welcome. done. Welcome Load on in. Survey. And then we do have a peon up here that can assist us. Uh, that we can build a forward barracks once we open up some space for them. Build more ships. We must break the Alliance fleet. The wind's on our side. Did you know that he wants us to build more ships? Awaiting your orders. Wait, really? It can't outrange a cannon tower? That doesn't seem right. Well, that's fine though. Unleash those cannons. Drown them all! Okay, move up. Assist. Build more ships. Our gold mine is running low. Awaiting you. Okay, come on down here. Help me out. Yes. Oh, yeah, our, okay, we're 3-3. Three, three. Solid. Solid stuff. This mine has nearly been cleared out already. Send out scouts and find a new gold mine. Already done, bro. I'm, I feel like I'm moving kind of slow here, honestly. Um, a thousand oil for these. All right, pig farm time. What do you want? P for pig farm? And then these guys, I just come on down here and just get on lumber, please. We got plenty of gold, more than enough gold. I thought I had two catapults. What happened to my other one? I am ready. Did it die? I don't think so. Utak, Utak, Utak. Luktar. Yes. What are you looking at? Uh, wh why? Just shoot it. What are you doing? Zotar. Am I crazy? Huh? Did it not make it into a boat, maybe? It. it. We're complete. Okay. Come on over here. Go pick them up. I wait your orders, Captain. Chief. I'm sort of I feeling observe. like this is not going to be enough to destroy this base, but we'll see. Maybe it will. Want me to survey? Utak can do quite a bit. He's a real one. Okay, come on down here. Let's keep build more ships. Force them to remake those transport ships. It seems like they're attacking us from this island. Ah! Dive it! Get it! It's no problem. Hey, back away. We got a nice little fleet here. Yeah, 
It's not huge, but it's it's I not bad. Ready. Destroy the crates, Utak Strike Force. You're dead. If that is my task, for Doom Get in there. And then we gotta load this thing up. Dude, without music. It, 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 it's hurting me a little bit. Yes. Utak, sip up. I think we're doing okay. Oh, they have no upgrades, and we're 2-2, two -two, so I think I think this is fine. That was, like, their main defensive group. So, next, let's ro let's roll on down with this peon. I also have pillage. Very valuable here. I observe Luktar. And then we'll slowly but surely... Oh, okay. Wait. Guard tower. What do you want? <laughs> I I was I knew I was like sort of ready for that. I can do that. That doesn't take too long to build. Okay, and then worker, come on down here. We're gonna set this up. I don't even think I need this expansion at this rate, but that's that's okay. The ogres get pillage. Excuse me. I am ready. Very nice. If that is my task. Sogzok. Destroying our city. Okay, then Sog come on Sog. down to, to that area. Come on, guard tower. Oh, maybe these guys can just attack it. What exactly are you up to? It's nice that Chogol can attack air. Go, I have Kilrog. Scout for me, my child. Go! Okay. Man, this is just it's just so slow paced. <laughs> it's so slow paced. Here, come on up here and grab this gold that I left on the ground. Okay. Heroes get up here. They they circumvented us a little bit. Direct us to an oil patch. Let's see if we can kind of skirt our way down here because we're gonna set up some stuff. Down here later. I can also move my Lutar. workers that exist up here, but that seems like it would take a while. Yes. What the heck was that? I observe. Invisible that Murlocs? Task, I am ready. Want me to survey? Luke Tar. It's clobbering time. Okay. Zog Zog. If that is my task. I observe. Um, more pig farms, I guess, or are we capped at 130? They get healed as well from the flippin'... From the flippin' campfire. I don't like that. What's going on down here? Utak Strike Force doing the Lord's work. Okay, is this almost done? And then this gold mine's almost out. I guess let's send this up here to pick them up. Chief, I observe. There's just so much around this map to to look for. A ritual dagger. Go get it, Utak. My bow is ready. Sacrifice is a friendly undead unit to heal a hundred points to all units around it. That seems good, I guess. Chief. Yes. In my book. There's another gold mine down here. It seems like it's mostly air units that could be a problem, so we're gonna make more destroyers. It seems like we sort of cleaned out their ability to do much here. Fire. Just roll in and hit this cannon tower from the shore. Work complete. I feel like I'm just being very diligent at this point, when in reality I could just go and win, probably. Take this out. Yeah, 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 yeah. 
So we do have to destroy the castle. That's the runestone. Okay. Destroy. Okay, you all just chill. What's going on down here? I am ready. Look tar. I mean lumber is fine. If that is my task. And then I'm curious if I auto attack up Who's here if they'll figure it out. We gotta we gotta dive this thing. This is much more important to kill. Alright, back him up. Back him up, back him up, back him up. I would love to destroy that. I would love to. Okay, we basically put a halt to any attempt that they have to attack us. It seems like they can kind of get to us up here sometimes. I also have these things. Let's get this started. And then all of you... Something ready to work. Build more ships. We must break the Alliance fleet. Okay. He wants even more ships. Bro, we're, we are. Well, I'm not... Actually, I was going to say, I'm not building more ships, but we're doing fine, I should say. We're doing absolutely fine. Get some juggernauts and these. That's a lot of money. That's actually probably too much. Ready to work. Okay, come on up yes. here, get repaired, I'm get repaired, get repaired. Orders. That's coming in just fine. We're not capped at 130. Uh, this is coming up for more oil. Uh, we also want to look for... Oh, we made it in here. Well, I think we figured out the way. Want me to survey? The question is, is this survey? enough stuff... To kill all of this. Okay, get me a barracks. I can do that. Juggernaut operational. And we're repairing, everything's fine. Great. Okay. Well yes, Captain. Repair that and that. We got these boats coming in. I have a transport ship. Let's go ahead and grab all those idle workers. Something they're doing. And get in there. Need a lift. Yes. If you can. This is why I hate doing boat transportation. Okay. Trees. What do you want? More pig farms. I can destroy Come down and kill that. There's just a lot of little things I'm trying to keep track of right now. We'll just make some enforcers and they can focus on this. Did we make it up here? Chief. We got the big ones up here. This this I might be a little challenging. We'll see. I, am ready. I don't have any undead units to help me here. I don't think this is going to be enough, actually, to kill this. Because that's level 9. Don't worry, Utax got it under control. Maybe. <laughs> yes. Okay, we'll come back to this. Even though it's going to take 8 to 10 years to slowly, slowly, slowly walk around. Like, it's just, again, it's just everything is so slow. I am ready. I observe your command, master. That's why these maps take so long. It's just because everything feels very sluggish. Chase that down. You Heroes get ready. You guys get in here. Complete. I await your orders, Captain. He awaits our orders, Captain. Your command, Master. All hands on deck. Drop these workers off here. Um, what? Again, it's just like hard for me to conceptualize what I should be doing. It's just we'll just make transport ships, make a bunch of transport ships, and then just start making a lot, lot, lot of catapults because we know we always need catapults. We'll load those up. We'll get up there and attack this. Eventually, when we have a few more units. 
We have oil coming in, but we don't really need that much right now, I don't think. Even though Gul'dan says, build more ships. Oh, they can attack each other. That's interesting. Okay, let's, uh, let's keep exploring a little bit and let's grab our other subs so that we can look for different subs. And then... Here, archers, come on down here. On the move. Uh, what? I don't even know yes, what next, man. This is... <laughs> it's just like... A lot of waiting for units to slowly make their way places. We're gonna have to attack up that. And this isn't connected to other stuff. My boy lived. I'm gonna quick save and then just try and... Let, give me a second, I'm gonna... Experiment with the music. I really hate that there's no music. Okay, we're good. There is now music. That helps. Otherwise, this is just strange and awkward. So I'm glad, you know, I waited a little too long, but now we have it. Okay, so I'm just building a bunch of transport ships. I'm building a bunch of catapults. Let's build a bunch of ogres. And then we're just going to steadily get ready to go and attack over there. I can also build... Um, a bunch of bowmen and leave them kind of on the edge here and we'll bring those with us. We have a little group here. This might be enough. U new, a new, a restructured and rebuilt Utak strike group. We do have double music, but it's better than no music in my opinion. I guess I'll build this. I don't know what attack to these guys. Come on. Got him. Okay, and then... Ships? Let's build... I can't build more submarines? Oh, that sucks. Um, give me a worker. Build a barracks. Give me a worker. Build an, that thing. Yep, that's fine. I... I hate... Okay, so we have some more income down here, I guess, if we need it. We gotta kill these things. Did they rebuild more out of the Beast Mound? That, that would be interesting if that is the case. I don't think they did, but... Meat for Utak? You love to see it. Oh, he's gonna come back. Oh, he does have purge. Work complete. Work complete. Yes. Okay, destroy this. A Sobe mask. That's pretty good. Yes, I would love an infernal, please. Orb of frost. Just get rid of this, who cares? Grab the orb. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Grab the orb. Grab a this thing. Um, the orb's gotta go on someone else. The orb of frost, otherwise it's pointless. You guys come all the way down here for Utok Strike Force, I guess. Attack these huts. Build more ships. We must break the Alliance fleet. If I have to hear him say that one more time, I'm gonna lose Aye, it. Captain. Yes, Captain. The crew awaits your order. Okay. Just load up. Start building some... Uh, we need more oil. Okay. We have these destroyers. Come on down here and kill this. You guys... Do something. I don't know, man. Okay. This, just make some zeppelins, please, and let them shoot. Then, transport ship come on over here so we can make another round. How many times is he going to say it? How many ships does he want? 
Hello? Great. Okay. Now you can kill those guys. You guys get on gold. Sure. You guys... I guess rebuild this? Okay. I had several transport ships full of stuff. Where did I send them? They're up here. Okay. And it's not really that many. Keep loading up. Keep load. Just get in the boats. Come on. You can do it. We're waiting. We've been waiting for a, forever. Just get in there. All right, you guys. We're going to drop you off right here. All hands on deck. And then let's take a transport ship down here and pick up some workers. Good chunk of workers. Good chunk of workers. Just bring all these. Okay, There's. it feels like there's still so much to explore. You come all the way down here, please. Hang on. Explore the, the areas for more... Yeah, just go crazy and look all around, please. We're looking for more uh, subs. There was one. Okay, delightful. Please, just unload them. Okay, we're finding more turtles. Bring them over. And then we're scouting more. Is there anything in this area for Utak Strike Group to engage with? Uh, that up there we want to go to. I guess we'll pick up the lumber. And the lumber... I almost feel like there's this is it's like too big. It's too much. It's too it's too hard to find everything in this. It's just it's Get on with it. I am ready. I'm itching to, to for this to end. And also because we started with, you know, 10 to 15 minutes of cinematics at the start, which is not inherently bad or anything. It's just that's another reason why I'm like, okay. Let's let's wrap this up, please. Okay, there, Utak Strike Force is doing it. He's doing it. Great. Destroy that stuff. Bring these workers down here so we can get some barracks set up. And ogre mounds. Catapults. Go ahead and just start attacking into these clumps of units. I think these wanted to come and attack us at some point, but we're not going to let them. Great work. Let's try this. And just like that, most of our artillery is already gone. <laughs> Attack this. You will never desecrate this sacred site, demon spawn. Oh, I will, little elf. I will. Build more ships. We must break the Alliance fleet. Is this, I, uh, I'm lo I'm losing it, man. This is a lot for me. There's a level 10 hero casually here too. No, destroy the stables. Okay, th now what? We build more catapults. Workers? Yes. Be happy to. Can't build it. That's fine. That's enough. Okay. Get on with it. You guys back up. You guys roll in and destroy this and this and this. It's going to take some time. You might just end up rolling into it and dying. I wouldn't be surprised. Okay. Then, how do we get up here? I think we just walk up there. That's fine.
I think we can bring our other heroes here as well. I don't think that the enemy has a, a means of getting to us, so maybe we want to connect up with the Utak Strike Force. We're being attacked by green savages! Defend the camp, laddies! Wildhammer Dwarfs, what are they doing here? Hidden mission unlocked. Okay. Oh no, that's uh, somehow I have a peon selected. Okay. Um, so just walking up to these dudes. Function is okay. That's fine. So you guys come on down here. That's a tanker. Build more ships is probably what Gul'dan is thinking right now. Um, more lost turtles. Um, you just just make a just look around here. I just want to finish this side quest and then we can just get moving here. So make these. Something you're doing. It doesn't seem like there's much buildable space here. I'm not surprised. That seems to be a, kind of a theme. Yeah, what happened to my catapults? What? Be happy to. Just why? It's just it's just <sighs> Don't worry about it. Okay. Um you guys load up and let's go to this area and then let's send a group of transports down to pick up Utak Strike Force. Down here. And then we're going to convene together. Again, I don't think I need more boats. We can use the boats, I guess, to help us defend. Get on with it. Break and break. And we have to kill that thing with the... Let's get another ogre mount. We have to destroy the castle up there, too. No! Turtle, go and look. Just go ahead. You're gonna do great. Work complete. Okay, make all these. Tome plus two. Who gets it? Um, I mean, both of these heroes are gonna betray us, right? So I don't really feel great giving it to either of them, but I'll give it to Gul'dan. Okay, catapult. I guess we're gonna. More ships. We must break the alliance fleet. Okay, we found sort of we found some area here where like a bunch of their stuff is clustered up. If we destroy this, then we're maybe complete. we'll be in better shape. He, again, he wants us to build more ships. We're actually capped. Okay, come on down here, and then other ships over here. Let's build more ships. Okay, you guys at auto attack kind of down in that direction. And then let's destroy these. Alright. I can't I can't get to this. We must break the Alliance fleet. Can they maybe have a cap on the number of times he says that? It's it's literally over and over and over. Please turn that off. Okay, I'm just gonna let them slowly clean this up. Again, I'm looking for more turtles. There's two left. I've been all around this these areas, so who knows? Great. Destroy these. It's gonna be garbage. Okay. Build more ships. Uh, how is this man still alive? What is happening? Pick this up. Address the darkness itself. We make ogres, and we're gonna make a lot of bowmen. Okay, let's 
attack down here and get rid of that castle or barracks or whatever it is. This stuff got wiped out. That's great. What's up here? Just random junk. Do they have a shipyard down here? Anything that we could destroy? It doesn't look like it. Zeppelins, again, Just we're just looking for turtles. I don't know where they're at. I think we got rid of all the enemy shipyards so they can't attack us at all anymore. That's what it seems like to me. So let's just kind of move up here and get rid of their fleets. Build more ships, etc., etc. You guys come on over here. Yeah, we're gonna go with that. I think he just comes back over and over again at the runestone until we take it. That's what it seems like to me. I'm at the point where I, I feel like I might just not find the last turtles, but I'm sort of okay with that. Okay, Utak Strike Force, let's start loading you up. I forgot about you, honestly. Just get in the boats, I swear. Just get in the boats. Holy shit. Okay. You guys come on over here. That's a decent-sized force that we can add to our... Our group. That guy's gonna come back because he's an asshole. Build more ships. We must break the Alliance fleet. I think that's the remainder of the Alliance fleet. Load these up. Cool. Bring them down here. You guys get in position so we can attack the castle. Okay, you guys just just attack into this fortress. Cool looking fortress. Build more ships. We must break the alliance fleet. Build more ships. I'm actually maxed out. I have so much crap just sort of spread throughout the map. I'm not surprised that now I can't build anything else. Okay, Utak Strike Force has arrived. Just attack in this. I, I, I've, I've lost a lot of patience. At this point, we've just got to smash our way through whatever in these areas. But of course, it's just like, you know, stuff on high grounds. So immersive. Now you can experience the true boredom of a real siege. Oh my god. We're almost there. Chogal gets a level. I really like that shockwave ability, so I'm gonna stick with that. Build more ships. That should keep us relatively safe. Okay, delightful. Coins. Just what I always wanted. What exactly are you up to? Okay, Gul'dan, get down here. We did unlock the secret mission. We'll quick save now so I don't have to replay all this with cheats if something goes wrong with the menu like it did last time. This guy, it seems like, yeah, he's just going to keep coming back. It's not the end of the world, but I don't love it. Okay, just get on the thing.
Oh, I thought we'd have to stand on it, but I think... I thought we'd have to hold it, but we don't. Great. Okay, cool. The ritual has begun. It's updating their drip. It's not just giving them the powers of the Magi, it's giving them hoods and sashes. It's gonna save them a lot of money in the long run, really. Although the monolith was destroyed during the ritual, its fragments still emit powerful magic. Collect these fragments and use them to build the altar of great power. With them, we shall forge what the Kurayan Empire could not. An entire legion of ogre magi. Several weeks later, Gul'dan presented the new ogre magi to Doomhammer. Why do you wait so long? As you can see, War Chief, my warlocks and I can still contribute to the Horde. Quite impressive, Warlock. I haven't seen older Magi in such numbers since the days of the Gorian Empire. I want you to send these mighty brutes to all Orcish forces in the region. They will be of great use as we escalate our assault on Lord Ron and Quelthalas. It will be done, War Chief. But remember, Gul'dan, my eyes are still upon you and your clan. You and your creations are to remain utterly loyal to me. Do not repeat the mistakes of the past or suffer the consequences. I won't, Doomhammer. <laughs> this time, I won't. are very impressive, master. Their cunning and cruelty is now comparable only with yours. Good. <laughs> As I exactly planned for. Build more ships. <laughs> I, uh, I feel like this map was, like, really small in scope. Like, I, if you just wanted to beat it, it would go really quick. But it just was so big and traversing all around it to look for stuff. Like, I'm glad I did, because otherwise there's no way I would have found the secret mission. Which, by the way, I have to hit continue. Otherwise, I might not unlock the button. But, um, it's just, I, I feel like this map is a good example of one where it's, like, there's too much on it or it's a little too big. I'm not really sure, one or the other, or maybe both of those things. It's like, for its own good. Uh, it's like, a lot of the exploration has basically no benefit to it. I guess if you were taking two hours on the map and you needed all those extra gold mines, I can't imagine why you would need two, three extra gold mines at the bottom of the map. So it just felt like all that was down there for not much of a reason. Um... Like, don't get me wrong, I, I like these maps. I think the most the most enjoyable thing for me is the visual aspect of what this what this project presents. 
is very engaging because of the music, the sound effects, and the um, and the visuals. And then also, you know, adding some improved or or I should not improved per se, but more recent mechanics such as including heroes and then roping in like the WoW lore. But there are some things when it comes to the map design, map designs that it's all they're almost like too I dense isn't even the right word. I would say like that lower left area was too dense and it didn't necessarily need to be. And I think coupled with the fact that everything just feels very sluggish. Like I'm on the fastest game speed, but it just feels like to do anything, it takes a really long time. And what that translates to is the maps taking longer than I feel like they need to. Like, I just load up some dudes in a boat. They don't get in the boat right away. So then I have to, like, spam click and get dudes into the boats. That alone is already obnoxious. Then I have to move the transport boats down there to wherever I'm dropping them. And that takes, like, 30 seconds to a minute. And then if I have to make another trip, I have to send them back. And then at that point, I'm getting impatient. So I just build new transport boats. So now I've doubled the amount of transport boats, taking away from the supply that I could use to build other units. You know what I mean? It's just like a lot of this stuff, it's just sort of the way, when it all kind of falls in together, I feel like does make for a, a gameplay experience that, again, I, I, I it just feels kind of sluggish. It makes me feel impatient. And I'm not sure if there's a way that is, is it just like the unit movement speed? If the unit movement speed could be sped up, I realize that that would if it affect the enemies as well, which could make it become overwhelming at times. But in general, I guess even compared to normal Warcraft 3, I don't know if it's because the camera zoomed out more. It just feels like we're moving slower and the having to use transports so much. It just, I don't know. It's just not, it's not hitting for me as much for these reasons, but Again, I think more importantly is just sort of the immersiveness that this provides um, for the things that I listed at first. So I don't want to lose sight of the things that I do really like. I just think that at times I, I feel myself getting antsy. I'm like, there's all these things I got to explore, these camps. What if they drop a tome? What if they drop good items? And then I'm like, at this point, it's been so long. I don't even care anymore. Can we please just just move on? And I, I don't know. That might frustrate some viewers. I like being really comprehensive when I do these maps. So I will keep exploring, but again, then I end up feeling like I start getting a bit salty when I'm like, all right, let's get this show on the road because I'm waiting for units to walk their way from one point to another point, and it takes really long. <laughs> so I don't know. I'll just try and keep this in mind and, and maybe try and head it off as we, um, as we move forward and maybe try and be a little more proactive and move a little faster from the start of the map instead of waiting as long. And that, that probably will help as well. All right, hey, thanks everyone for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye.